Hello there, it's Ruth here and welcome to my weekly Oracle coaching video. I hope you are safe and well wherever you are in the world. And in my part of the world, in the Northern Hemisphere, with some bright sunshine this morning and it's feeling like spring, which makes me feel very hopeful. But the purpose of these weekly videos is to ask the universe for a message that can help us this week to connect to our intuition so we can feel more empowered and life becomes easier and we can all do the great things that we're meant to be doing. So this week I'm using Wisdom of the Oracle deck by Colette Baron reed it's a great deck, and I ask the universe, what do we need to know this week to stay connected to our intuition and to serve our highest good? And the response is, unfinished symphony. So if you've got the song going round in your head, unfinished symphony, me too. Um, but here we have a woman sat on the egg and we can see the keyboard just going on to infinity. And what does unfinished symphony mean? Well, clearly it's about something that's unfinished. It's not done. So do you have a project? Do you have something that you need to do that is kind of in the back of your mind? And every time you think about it, you go, oh. you, you give a sigh because you know you're procrastinating, you're not quite sure where to go next with it, but you've got lots of great ideas about other things to do. Well, before you move on to starting any other project, just look at the one that's getting your attention now. It could be an unfinished project, an unfinished piece of work. It could be something in the home, if not work related. It could be something in your personal life. Maybe you're in the sad position of a relationship coming to an end and you still feel that you haven't quite moved on yet, there are things left unsaid, so it may be that you need to say those to yourself. And one of the great things to do in those situations, if you can't talk to the other party involved, is write a letter, get it out of your system, put it in your journal, and sometimes writing a letter and then tearing it up or burning it and just throwing it away can do the job of releasing that emotion from you. But check in with yourself, what in your life is unfinished this week? You know, have you still got some bookcases to build that you bought at the start of lockdown last year and a year, a year later they're still there? You know, what is it? There's something in your life that needs your attention this week. You may not want to do it, but in order to move forward with other things in your life, there's something that you need to finish up. So whatever that is this week, I wish you lots of courage if you need it. I wish you love if you need it to get that thing finished. And know that you can do it. Once you do it, you're going to feel great and you can move on to other things. But whatever it is, you have the strength, the courage and the resources to do it. Know that about yourself. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, you can get these videos every week or you can sign up to my newsletter www.ruthrichards.org to get my newsletter each week as well. So wishing you a fantastic week and I'll see you again next week for the next one. Bye bye.